Alright YouTube, long time no see. Now I'm sure doing my app since you guys have probably heard of this game called Splitgate. Personally, it reminds me of Overwatch mixed with Portal 2. To a lot of people, it's a quite unique game. It completely blew up going from like 200 members to 400,000 members even after being in the beta stage for over two years and we're gonna play it today. Now obviously considering my small YouTube size, this video is not sponsored by Splitgate or any company in affiliation with the game. I'm just giving you the rundown, but what better way to show you the gameplay than to actually play the game? Everyone knows you need to warm up in anything you do. Don't know, I don't have a clue what this is. Wait, this is Team Deathmatch? If you're in the vicinity, you have like... <laughs> Alright, well, I mean, I guess it was a noble sacrifice. There's 11 games. Alright, we gotta be careful. I say that, meanwhile I rush into my portal, dying immediately. Last man standing. Let's just go for the melee. Oh, this guy looks like a like a split gate pro! <laughs> oh, we already got toxicity in split gate. You know, I think the game plan is going for is going for more portal kills as opposed to any other kills, right? They can't really see from here. I know I have an assault rifle. Get back in. Easy. That's what you gotta do. They can't see your portal from the other side. Let's do that again. That worked last time. Oh. oh no, I saw that coming from a while. No. I saw that coming from a mile away when he started shooting at the portal. Placing another portal right there. Main net me. A load of trouble. Oh no. One enemy remaining. Great, now I gotta clutch up for my team. You like him and don't like him, there's nothing you could do about him because he's number one. Whether you like him or don't like him, there's nothing you can do about him because he's number one. That was just not clicking for me. That was not clicking for me. Oh, we went a full circle. That was really close though. I knew where he was coming from. I just, it didn't click that I just came out of that portal. It didn't click that I just came out of that portal. I gotta be better next time. All right, this this game mode has us really tightly knit. There's only an odd amount of games. So if it gets to a point where there's a tiebreaker, that's gonna be, that's gonna be uh, concerning. I sense a death in my near future. Last man standing. Okay, now we gotta win three games in a row. This is not fun. This. Last man oh, standing. oh. One. Great, now if I die, then it's all on me. And that's how you do the play! Alright, we're playing Team Deathmatch on this map that I really haven't played before. And there's people here. How many hits in the head does it take to kill, to kill an enemy player? Ask the question. See, you gotta work with the portals, you know? Nice portal. You know, honestly, I thought the 50 damage enough would be, be good to kill him, but... No, I don't. I don't really want. Personally, I don't want to die today. It's not especially by a TSM member. Good to know that my kill was not in vain. Nice one. Oh, that the, with the winning kill? Victory. That was a good game for me. 
Let's see if we can replicate it. I think I should save my favorite game mode for last. It is Team Oddball. Now, personally, I love playing this game with friends. It is so fun. It The concept is really just good all around. You fight with the ball. You hold the ball. How long can you hold the ball? It's just fun. So basically, the premise of the game mode is to obviously hold the oddball. Now, when you have possession of the oddball, you have insane power. This swift moving ball allows you to completely decimate any player that comes in your path. Now, if I stay by my team, I should be good, but everyone can see where I am, and that's the downside. For example, I got hit by an imaginary force. One thing I really would like to add or update to this game mode is uh, damage being done when you get a kill with the oddball. Because getting killed with the oddball, it's no easy feat. They saw me. I would have been I would really would have been glad to drop the ball off the platform. Now, what a lot of people don't know, surprisingly, I mean, considering how new the game is, in a sense, I mean, the game's not new, but... Oh, that's where I wanted to go. Close the gap. No, no, no! Oh, it's not where I wanted to be. Is there even any way to get back up? There has to be. Some trajectory. Some elite angle. You start throwing a grenade at me and think it will take damage? Come on, just kill that guy. The person with the all ball does not know that they can just decimate any player. Well, I accept my death because I somehow missed all my shots. Come on, teammate. You got that teammate right there. And he dropped it. That ball has <laughs> some of the weirdest physics I've ever seen. Oh my gosh. And the way I evade this scenario, all right. I'm falling down. Ooh. How did I get here? Am I dying? No. Okay. Should have fell in the portal. What's our score? 113. I got an 106 score for our team. No, maybe I may be a hog. Alright, alright. As, as long as one of our teammates has it. Oh. Oh no. This is a rather confusing turn of events. Wait, you could place a. You could place a. Did not know that. I gotta keep an eye on my teammate who's flying across the map. Easy. Victory. And that is why it's my favorite game mode. It's so tame. And yeah, I did pretty well. I got them like half, I made up half the score for my team, which is pretty nice. And I guess it's gonna wrap it up for this game. So thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you wanna see more videos uploaded, then leave a like and comment that you wanna see more videos uploaded. I'll try uploading more, but since I haven't uploaded in two months, it's going to be pretty hard to get back into the groove of things. So I'll see you guys later. Thank you guys so much for watching. Goodbye.